Yeah, before, before I go into the library, I'm gonna give a tip about the N1s. Because see, sometimes I look at, uh, and I, yeah, I don't look at the video, but I look at the title of certain you know, individuals' videos. Because I want to see who's praising God and who's not. Sometimes you can just tell by the title that some are praising humanism and not praising God. You can, you know, so you know not to go to it. Of course, you know, you know, don't click it on. So the point is this, you know, I see some people's videos have lust this, lust that, lust, 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 lust. And see, let me tell you something. How you can, how you can get an N1, and they say a lot of things about witchcraft. How you get an N1 with lust and witchcraft is by not going to those that are, that are lusting and not going to those that are doing witchcraft. Have you not read the Old Testament? That's the point. So see, this is you know this is this is encouragement. This this is encouragement for the Most High God, right? See, you have to follow God because see, if you go to witchcraft and if you go to people that's lusting on YouTube, then you're taking part of that. See, so so you can't cancel cancel somebody out of lust if you're in lust. That's the point. And how about the thing is where you're in lust. So see, this this is what it is, ladies and gentlemen. You don't have to try to usurp someone else to get your point across. See, what you have to do, you have to be delivered from what you're talking about. Because see, like they say, what's inside in you is what's coming out. So, right. So, you know, some of you, you can use the help. Like I said, I don't even have to listen to your video. I could feel the, the pain you're going through because, right, because you're saying this and shit. And I, had, I remember one, one of the sisters, I had watched her video, me and my wife, we, 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 we watched her video. Um, she had said, you know, some people, uh, sometimes women in particular claim, oh, I'm happy being single. I'm happy going to bed and by myself. I'm happy loving God. And they might be happy loving God, but at the same time, they're not happy within their life because they're content with trying to uh, break up uh, marriages. They're content with, you know, interfering in people's lives. And then, right, and then they're guilty of what they're trying to counsel against. So, oh, ye hypocrite. You have to follow Christ. Because, see, I first hand can tell you. I first hand can tell you. Christ will deliver you from that lustful spirit. Ask Christ for the man or the woman that you're looking for. And then you have to repent for following those that are in witchcraft. You can't follow those in witchcraft, follow those that are lusting, or follow those that are prideful, you know, and, and think that it's not going to wear off on you. You're not supposed to associate with the unrighteous. That's the point. And see, YouTube have got some of you so confused, you think because you come on YouTube, you can do that. No. Oh, you hit, oh, you foolish hypocrites. You can't do that. So, see, I'm just doing this out of love. I'm doing this to glorify God because, see, earlier I was going to make another kind of video. Father God told me not to. So I said, Father God, you reach in my heart and have, have me speak what needs to be spoken. So let me just tell you, listen, you can't be entering YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, or just in the world itself. You can't be entering uh, with lustful people and prideful people and this kind of people and, and, and think that you're actually going to get away with counseling them when you yourself are partaking in the thing you see, even though some of you don't want to admit it, you're, you're partaking in these things that you're saying. Right, you're either lusting in the spirit, trying to divorce and break things up, and you, as you can see, it's not working. So you come up with your own accusations, your assumptions, and you're not glorifying God. You're using, you're using a form of godliness that sounds correct and it sounds pure, and it's helping people, but at the same time, you got your eyes on a target. So God is saying, stop that, because your witchcraft has been figured out. You may have been cunning, crafty, clever, you might put on a smile, but it's just that sister said, you need to stop acting like that, acting, acting like you're happy. You want more, ask Christ for it and he'll give you. And that's how you get an in one, by pr practicing what you preach and by coming out of it in Jesus' name. Spread out in the gospel, in one.